All right, for more, let's get in a word from our editor, South TS Sudhir, who's with us this evening. Also with us from the national capital is our correspondent, Kamajit Sandhu. I want to come to you first, uh, Sudhir. How is the decision to not declare Telangana a union territory likely to impact street protests? Well, uh, Hyderabad has been a bone of contention right from the time that this Telangana bill was being drafted and obviously uh, the, the, the proposal to declare it as a union territory came from the Simandra union ministers led by people like Chiranjeevi, Pallam Raju and K.S. Rao who believed that this could be one major concession that they could take for the people of Simandra. Mainly two reasons. One, of course, the safety and security of the people of Simandra who are settled in Hyderabad. Nearly 35% of Hyderabad's population in the greater Hyderabad municipal limits is from people from Simandra and obviously there were concerns whether they will be safe in, in a Telangana which is ruled by a Telangana government led by parties like Telangana Rashtra Samiti uh, and they believe that a union territory status would actually assault those fears. The second is of course of financial um, packages uh, whether there could be some kind of a revenue sharing of the revenue which is being generated in Hyderabad for both states Telangana as well as Simadra depending about the population but yes there has been opposition from votaries of Telangana to such a proposal because they believe that if law and order in particular is with the central um, is a central subject like the case in Delhi it will lead to a lot of problems in fact uh, ministers and public representatives from Hyderabad in particular have been opposing it even opposing it in the draft bill where the governor is put in charge of law and order which will mean that the Hyderabad police commissioner will actually report to the governor of Telangana who will in turn report to the union home ministry so that's something which is not acceptable to the voters of Telangana in fact it is one of the main amendments which has been moved by the Telangana MLAs in the Andhra Pradesh assembly all right, uh, let's also get in a word uh, from Kamaljeet Sandhu. Kamaljeet, uh, this is uh, a politically sensitive uh, issue. In fact, the Supreme Court also refusing to stay tabling the Telangana bill in Parliament. There were several pleas filed before the apex court. Well, Telangana has been a big issue uh, since the announcement made by P. Chitamram uh, three years ago. But remember, uh, since then, Congress has not been able to do much. Many said they had lost a lot of time. But this is an election year. They have to perform. And uh, despite having said a lot on Telangana, remember, even there is a parliament impasse. Uh, their own uh, Chief Minister, Kiran Kumar Reddy, is not uh, siding with them. So in that sense, uh, it seems to be a huge uh, political hot potato. Uh, but now they've decided to bite the bullet. Uh, the cabinet meeting, I must tell you, is really on at this point of my time uh, this is a special cabinet meeting uh, yes uh, as far as uh, decisions are being taken uh, after uh, having a cabinet note prepared uh, there was still a group of ministers meeting and thereafter yesterday we saw that home ministry officials were working round the clock Jairam Ramesh visiting these particular officials giving direction and remember from the top uh, notch Congress uh, leaders uh, the instructions have clearly come uh, that there has to be a line which has to be taken uh, the Telangana votes right. cannot can have to be consolidated and that is why we know that the Hyderabad will not be given a UT status they do realize that there are certain complications even though Seema, minister, Seema Andhra ministers who had come to meet uh, the Home Ministry and other ministers, group of ministers clearly said that in an election year they want to go down to the people and tell them right. uh, that they have to have a certain face and that is why they are demanding a union territory status and remember uh, being an influential globby, a uh, lot of people have stake in Hyderabad, uh, it's not just just the capital right. city, it's also a big uh, city in terms of infrastructure, a lot of stake in Hyderabad, uh, but definitely uh, as far as the economics are concerned, uh, there would be, uh, the assets would be seen by the 14th Financial Commission, which will see what are the assets present in yes. both the states, the Telangana right. and the Andhra, uh, there would be a division and perhaps a better compensation would be given to Seema Andhra, considering that they are not willing to give Hyderabad the status, uh, the union territory status. All right, Kamaljit Sandhu and uh, TSOZ, thanks so much for that update. We'll continue tracking developments. On to our other.